Tripura Deputy Chief Minister and State Finance Minister Jishnu De Barma today presented the state budget estimated over rupees 26,000 crore and tax-free. This was the fifth and the last budget of the pre uh, present uh, BJP IPFT government in Tripura ahead of the state polls next year. Now, the no new tax budget has been presented with a deficit of rupees 559.74 crore. This year's budget increased by 18.34% compared to the last year's budget. While tabling the budget, De Barma said that there is no new tax proposed in the budget and the deficit would be covered by better fiscal management and smart tax collections. De Barma further said that the philosophy of the budget is collective action and inclusive growth and with better tax management. The budget contains several new plans including Rs 1000 crore for infrastructure and development under the Suvarna Jayanti Tripura Nirman Yojana scheme besides increasing the social pension from rupees 1000 to rupees 2000 the state gsdp has been estimated to grow at 13.28 percent with enhancement of 20.66 percent in education and 23 percent in health sector meanwhile speaking exclusively to our assistant news editor pinaki das de barma talked of the finer points regarding the budget he presented today which are the third area in which you are invested? The first, uh, first area is capital expenditure for development of the state because it has been languishing without development for the last 30 years, 40 years. So uh, we have kept a, made a new fund, new fund, which is known as Sonra Jayanti Nirman Fund, which will have 1,000 crore rupees, the first time in Tripura, such a fund. And through that fund, we will go through capital expenditure, see that maximum is spent on capital expenditure infrastructure, so that will also create jobs. That will create jobs and plus Atto Nirbhar will go a long way in making the people Atto Nirbhar, so where else will spend that? Second thing is our social pensions, which was in our vision document, was 1,000 rupees till now. We had promised to make it 2,000. We have made it today through the budget, 2,000 rupees social pension, which will benefit 3,81,000 3, families. So the people must be having about 9,000, 10,000 families. So four, four, uh, four lakh families will be benefited through this pension. And uh, in education, we have put a lot of thrust. We have increased the education budget from last year to 20% more. And uh, capital expenditure, I said, has been doubled. Double. Besides that, uh, Subhanna Joyanti, we have also doubled the expenditure for uh, what, what, uh, capital expenditure. For health, we have um, uh, 23%. So all the you know, core sectors have been increased. And the uh, outstanding feature of this budget is that every announcement that I have made has been backed up by finance. By a final, final, we have kept a position, provision in the budget to finance every announcement I have made. TSR, age. TSR age has been, you know, increase, retirement age has been increased from 57 to 60. That is also done. Opposition has always tried to criticize, and they this time has raised this is a budget which is for the election. How do you respond to that? Well, if the elections around the corner, should we not make a budget? Election or election budget has to be made no? at the end of the financial year. And uh, they can see it for the elections, but we see it as for development of Tripura. Thanks. So, Thanks. Th that was uh, Tripura's finance and deputy chief minister who said, this is, if it's election knocking the door, was harm if you make a budget uh, which is focused at the election, but the people are ultimately to be benefited out of it. With camera person Vishwajit, this is Pinaki Das for Northeast Life from Agartala.